Hey guys, it's Panther Sam back with another video. Today I'm going to be reacting to the NFLPA decision about two changes that will impact the season a lot and also the Ryan Tannehill signing. First, we're going to go over the NFLPA. So the NFLPA agreed to make the season from 16 games to 17 games and then take away one preseason game, which would make three preseason games instead of four. And then the regular season, 16 instead of 17. And then they also decided to make it a 14-team playoff instead of the current 12. Yeah, 12. So it'd be two extra teams, one per conference. And then now let's go over the Ryan Tannehill. So Ryan Tannehill today has agreed for a four-year deal, $118 million with the Titans, which is about 29.5 per year and 62 guaranteed. So... I think the Titans wasted a lot of money on him because, yeah, he played good last year, but I think he really just played well because the teams had to expect the run from Derrick Henry so they couldn't protect for pass. But since Derrick Henry is a free agent, if the Titans don't re-sign him, I think Tannehill's going to have a really hard time back there because they're not going to be keying on the run since they don't have Henry and Henry's, and Henry's good, so it makes them key in on him. So then Tannehill would have easy little passes to complete. So I would say if Derrick Henry does not get re-signed for the Titans – uh, Ryan Tannehill's not going to play anywhere near what he got paid. But we'll have to see. Maybe he'll maybe he'll m make me change my mind. Maybe I don't think he's as good as he was. But just based on how he's played in Miami when he was there and how he played last year, I just don't see him being worth that much anywhere near that. But we have to see when the season starts. If the season starts this year, to see if it gets delayed like all the other sports, like NHL, NBA, so on and so forth. But, yeah. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye, guys.